a nice long hike at a trail which is kind of like a national reserve. That's where I'm going next. I came from back there. And you can see there's lots of lots of clouds in the sky because it's gonna rain soon. But over on this side, it's a very blue sky. And I just came to a place which used to be um, a building. Now it's called Ruins because all the pieces of the building have fallen down. And this building here is probably about 500 years old. And the time when the Spanish first came to do what they call colonizing, um, in Puerto Rico and in other countries and islands in the Caribbean. Um, yeah, and it looks pretty cool. And over here, if you can see far away, this is a place called La Laguna de Cofresi. Cofresi Lagoon. And Cofresi was actually a pirate. He was the most famous pirate to uh, of, of Puerto Rico. And he actually like lived around here in my town called Cabo Rojo. And this lagoon is named after him. Um, and legend says that he would hide his treasure here he would come in his boats and somewhere around here in some caves he would hide his treasure which i think is pretty cool but i don't think anybody has found any treasure after looking for it um what else can i tell you this um well how about i just show you this is pretty cool all of these bricks, they're hundreds of years old. And here, over here, we see a big doorway to what used to be uh, a building of the Spaniards. Spaniard is the name for people who came from Spain. Um, and I don't know. I think it looks really neat. Uh, maybe next time I'll tell you a little bit more about some history of Puerto Rico and other Latin American countries. Over here is a ruin which used to be a well. Right now it's filled up. But there you go. Now there's lots of different special types of birds who live in this area. There's a lot of different special kinds of trees and plants and cactuses. Um, so maybe another time I'll show you those. Bye! So here we are again looking at the Cofre Seed Lagoon from far away. I just want to zoom in a bit and show you what there is to see. These are some very large rock formations in the middle, which maybe we can get closer to and have a better look. In this picture, you can also see a very cool cloud formation. It's just, I was just walking on the trail and I saw these plants and I thought you would want to take a look at them. They're very, very interesting. They are not um, cactuses, but they have very spiky edges around their leaves. And if you see, I can touch it. The leaf itself is very, very thick. And some of the leaves are red. So that's a very cool different type of plant around here.